A male turkey is called a tom, a female turkey is called a hen, and newly hatched turkeys are called poults. The poults on our farm, they arrive the day that they are hatched and they come right from the hatchery. We raise toms, so these are the male birds. The toms are raised until they are 16 weeks of age, and at 16 weeks they weigh approximately 16 kilograms. Our birds are sold as ingredients that go into other food products. Other farmers that grow hens would stay on their farms for approximately the same length of time. However, those birds will be sold at the festive market to be enjoyed by families at different holiday seasons. So the turkeys on our farm go to being more conveniently packaged in different products such as turkey kielbasa or turkey hot dogs, ground turkey, there's a turkey breast or a turkey roll. So all of those types of items are what would come from our farm. We are proud turkey farmers and like all turkey farmers in Canada, we do not use growth hormones in growing our birds. The question that I am asked time and time again, which surprises me, is that people have the assumption that turkeys are grown in cages. And I think people are very surprised when they hear that our birds have a lot of space. And in our curtain-sided, open-style barns, they have access to a lot of fresh air and are very impressed by the, just the, the quality of life that they can have being somewhat close to the environment but still being raised in a controlled barn environment. Lighting is very important in the growth of a turkey, especially for the first three to 10 days, we are extra conscious because light actually helps them be able to reflect on water and it helps them find the water quicker. So it's one of those things, a well hydrated bird is obviously a content bird. So we make sure that in those early days that the lighting is nice and bright as they uh, move along through the stages, it's important for us to obviously control the lighting and have downtime for them to rest and then light so they are content and move throughout the barn and can see their water and see their feed and um, just have an environment that is pleasant for the bird. Everybody thought we were crazy for getting into toms because they're harder to grow. I think you need more patience. They're harder to start. Those first, that first week is critical in their growth. Uh, or you, you've slept in the barn before. Like just to make sure that the lighting, the temperature, the airflow, everything is correct because the last thing you want as a farmer is for them to not live and you need to make sure all those controls are obviously proper and that's kind of the extent of what we try to do every day is make sure that their environment is as perfect as you possibly can make it. <laughs>